it. Tovar, would you? How would you retaliate if Chris like ran Ooh. up to you when you were in your underwear in your home? And like, you know, uh -huh. like, and he snipped your testicle sack with like a pair of scissors. Oh my god! Like he chopped your ball I'd sack. I'd react in half. very angrily. I do that. But like, why? I but, mean, I'd be, f I'd be full of pain, but I'd be full of pain and anger. But like, all the wow. food that's in your balls like falls yeah, out. Yeah, and all the testosterone pumping no, into be, your angry yeah, brain. Yeah, you're like, you're like Hercules. When it would be a traumatic event that I'd never forget when the rest Hercules, of my when life. Hercules is like aging. That's you as the as the, <laughs> as the fluid drains your balls. Yeah, you're like a reverse you hole. You transitioned like in a erogenous tumor. Like, no, you, know, you picked stop. like the perfect oh. mental oh. image for what would happen if all my testosterone drained yeah. out. You turn into a K pop star yeah. and be really hot and yeah. flex. Chris, what do you think? <laughs> Chris, <laughs> just scoff. 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 Stop. Yeah, nice one, idiot. You don't think you can talk to me? <laughs> I'm so confused what you're talking about. You're ta we're talking about you pulling a little prank. A prank. Where you come out from under the table and snip Tomar's balls. It's not Chris is listening to me. You listen to the Albert Fudd voice. That's true. It's like, oh, I didn't hear what they said. I'm just going to do the Albert Fudd. I'm just going to go to the Albert Fudd.